Hey, Shauna K, ChallengeWorkouts.com. I create new challenging workouts for you. And today I want to, know, want to point out my awesome new t-shirt from Adam Steer and Bodyweight Burn. Thank you, Adam, for my new t-shirt. Uh, in exchange, I want to give you a fun challenge workout uh, for your readers. It's going to include squat jumps, decline push-ups, a bicycle crunch for your core, jumping lunges, and pull-ups. Uh, now I know not everyone can achieve a pull-up yet, so I want to give you a couple tips for the pull-up. First of all, before you get to do, um, before you do a pull-up, you're going to want to learn how to do a scapular retraction. And what that is, is when you hang from the pull-up bar with straight arms, look up and squeeze the shoulder blades together. You'll notice that my chest elevates to the bar just a little bit. That helps you to engage those stronger muscles of the back and that gets you in an advantageous pulling position. So my next tip is to make sure that you're bringing the chest under the bar instead of inwardly rotating the shoulders and trying to get the chin over the bar, which is a common mistake. Now, if you can't do a pull-up for this workout, you can do an inverted row, a TRX suspension row, a jump pull-up, or even a band-assisted pull-up, but with any of those movements, uh, whatever you do, try and concentrate on the eccentric contraction or the slow lowering of your body from the bar because that's the strength building phase. Now this is an AMRAP set uh, or workout, which means as many rounds as possible. So you're gonna set your timer for 15 to 20 minutes, as much time as you can afford. Uh, it's a full body workout and it's just body weight. So it's gonna include squat jumps. When you do your squat jump, try and get that bum as low as you can. Jump off the ground, throw the hands in the air. If you want a lessen impact, just come up onto the toes for a full body extension. Exercise two is a decline push up. So you're gonna have your feet on something elevated, chest to the floor. Uh, by the way, this workout's called Lucky Seven, so you're doing seven squat jumps, seven decline push ups. Next, you're gonna go to seven per leg um, bicycle crunches. All right, so 14 all together. Next, you're gonna do jumping lunges. So drop that back knee to the floor, seven per leg. If the jump is um, not working for you, you're just gonna do seven reverse lunges. Then we're gonna finish off with pull-ups. So you're gonna try and get seven pull-ups, whether they're assisted pull-ups or unassisted pull-ups. Then you're gonna go back to the seven squat jumps, try and get that as many times as you can in 15 to 20 minutes. It's an awesome workout. Thanks for the t-shirt, Adam. We'll see you again.